I'll stay right here. That should be good. I'll stay right here. Alright, shovel one, shovel one. First and foremost, before we start, as always, we're going to keep all praises out here. Yahweh, Ba'ashun, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashun, Rekha Gwadash. Also, double honors to the Apostles, the Holy Spirit, and the Salutation of the Jews. Which is another week. Alright, closer to salvation. The Lord's about to stop all this murder, man. Okay? You know, you got one coming up. Uh, well, shit, get the prize this weekend. The prize race. It's June! Okay. You got that. You got the fourth coming up. That shit, the money. All right, a bunch of festivals. Mm hmm Yep. You know, you had yeah, from Day Celebration with June. June! Uh, so the Lord is about to uh, stop all this shit, man. You know? Because all this stuff, you know, that our people do is smoke. All right, in his notes. Alright, from the adultery, spiritually speaking, to physical adultery, alright, to the drug use, you know, to, to the, kill, uh, the killing, uh, the stealing, you know, so on and so forth. The Lord's tired of this shit, man, and our people, you know, still talking on, still stuck on stupid, still uh, caught up in this world. Alright, the Lord, he's about to destroy this place because, look, we've been out here for how long, man? The apostles and their elders, decades after decades after decades. Enough's enough, man. God knows. Then, 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 if you're not down with that, yeah. they're, they're gonna be on uh, snitch culture, okay? <laughs> All right, and, and tell on you, man. Uh, you know, for, for for every little damn thing you do at the job. He or, didn't say anything, but I can know? just it just feels like he doesn't. Right. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? So you, you gotta be with this. Hey, that's what the scripture say. What is the spiritual side of the Right. You know, yeah. this place is a, a goddamn nightmare, man. That's right. This Jeremiah 10 and 1. Hear ye the word which the Lord speaketh unto you, O house of Israel. Thus saith the Lord, burn not the way of the heathen, and be not dismayed at the signs of heaven, for the heathen are dismayed at them. And that's what the brother was going into, man, you know, speaking on this present evil world, man, our people, you know, the so-called Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans, those who are scattered amongst these filthy heathens, man, the bloodline go back there from Christ and Jacob. Our people have learned the way of the heathen, Section 8, food stamps, okay, a, a government job in order to sustain yourself. They, they, how, why you, what the fuck do you, they said, well, what's it to celebrate? What the fuck are you so happy about? Well, yeah. you look at, like I said, you can smoke a fucking new pork, okay? okay. Yeah, you, you can go eat some fucking pork ribs. Yeah. Yo, uh, well, like you said before the camera started. Hey, I'm an elder, I got the longest dress Yeah, now. yeah, yeah. yeah. Polly. Yeah. Corny as fuck, bro. Look like a fucking bitch, bro. Great, with you. Then the bitches, uh, this is how demonic this place is. The main, 
got hair like women, and the women got hair like men, because the one, women now, they, they don't get lined up. That bitch got a line, and she going to sleep with a do-rag on, right. her shit. Look, man. And niggas going to sleep with buttons on, man. Yeah. Yeah, that nigga Snoop Dogg got these niggas on that. This is uh, verse 5, Ecclesiastes 7 5. It is better to hear the rebuke of the wise than for a man to hear the song of fools. Like the other brother was going into, Jacob rather listen to all these heathen instead of listening to us come out here and tell them to turn back to the Lord and to put all that foolishness aside. Man. Right. You know, like the scriptures say, you know, they want you to speak up to them smooth things. They're not interested in what's actually going to give them a smooth situation. They just want shit that sounds cool. Because as the scriptures say, all oh, they hate me, love death. Really, these people love a death style. That's yeah. why they, they continue to dwell in it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And quit crying at the funerals, man. Yeah. Alright, quit, quit making the, you know, uh, uh, somebody's face a, uh, you know, on a t-shirt. Part of your yeah, t-shirt. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you about, love this uh, shit, Talking man. about he was, uh, he was, he wasn't the best people I ever met. No, that nigga wasn't shit. And that's why the Lord killed him. Exactly. Right. You got Julio, Julio. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because I was doing that. I never knew nothing about some niggas in the floor. The fact that we're Julio, Julio, when this shit happened. Now I'm looking at him in young age, they wish shit they were doing. You can look at that nigga's face and tell he's a deep. God, hey, no, hey, no, these niggas, the black, the black fucking black community, that shit is just totally pure death culture. Black? Just total death. These niggas, everybody, they doing the same shit in the video. Everybody's got their guns, they're doing this with the guns and shit. Everybody's got their guns. 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 Everybody's be involved in that than, 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 than to enjoy real life. Right. You know, because hey, well, I'll say it is, hey, when brothers come to the street, hey, you ain't you you elevate, okay? Yep. Hey, brothers are in shape, yep. okay? They, they 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 work out, they drink water, yep. all right, get into the herbs, eat healthy. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Okay, hit, deal with a lot of women. Y'all said it. Read oh, gym sex. Okay. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. That's the that's the funny part. You guys are super wicked, but we get more pussy than you, man. Easy. Fuck out of here, man. You know what I'm saying? And hey, this shit's real, man. You know? And hey, we're really living here, man. You know, we understand what's the fuck. All right, we know the, 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 the future of things. All right? Why everyone is investing in this world. Hey, we're investing in Yahweh Shimei Oshai. This, this place is done, bro. Shit, bro, Russia just uh, attacked a, a training uh, 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 camp that, that, that's a part of NATO. Mm. What do you think's gonna happen, man? Mm. Why do you think they, uh, the, the, the U.S. government, all right, has a draft uh, put in place right now? Yep. Every, all you bitches too. And look, and that's a, I'm at the point now where you know the Lord is. is I, of course, I still get upset. But the Lord is, is is really giving me a lot of relief in my spirit because all these people that you look at that's not in the truth are dead, man. You niggas are dead on your feet. Once these goops and these Russians start falling out the sky. All these soft ass, budgy motherfuckers not gonna be able to do shit, man. These, like the pop star say, these, these rushes and these goops gonna come and take your food, man. And you ain't gonna have shit to say about it, you know? And see, Jacob crying, complaining, and, and this is what the killer part is. Like the scripture say, the things turned, the things turned upside down to be a speedy as the pirates play. All these Jakes wanna hear smooth things. We actually telling you the smooth things right now. Cause what we tell you, and Lord willing, we all endure, if you do what we tell you, what the scriptures say to do, the Lord is going to deliver you, man. And that's going to be the smoothest thing you've ever experienced. Because you niggas get stuck down here uh, before even the nukes come. If you ain't got the Lord covering you, Slow. it's going to be rocky roads coming ahead. Hey, it's, hey, it's already happening, man. And all these Venezuelans and, and, and Ecuadorians, whatever, oh, Guatemalans that are coming up here. They, they literally look just completely through, bro. Like, they're yeah. done. They, 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 they did the, the Cuba in the 80s shit. All these Venezuelans you see are niggas that was in the joint, man. Yeah. Facts. And, but, and, and bitches that was on welfare. My kids were scuffling because I was set up for two hours and watched the North Korean military parade. They speak in another language. I don't understand the shit they saying, but I'm watching it for two hours. When I mean, they got power rangers jumping at the sky, yeah, yeah. go in the bro. guard suits with RPGs. Bro. These niggas head button cinder blocks, bro. Four in the row. Literally. Four in the row, and then going and going to eat their dinner like this shit happened. Man.
and, and, and you fucking punk ass niggas eat McDonald's every day. Right. You really think some shit from the go down? Look, man, <laughs> these niggas not gonna West. be able to, you can't stop a, a one of these pookies from coming and taking your shit. Right. No training, no discipline. These goops gonna jump out the sky, these Russians, wow. the, even these Russians that are just here on the regular, the average Russian is, is, is a hard body motherfucker. Not in the military, not a fighter, just a regular Russian nigga, bro. Man, look, bro, all these niggas' ears fucked up, bro. Everyone. They got a whole different spirit, man, because right. look, in these other countries, shit isn't sweet, and their government also, it's actually in their school cur curriculum, yeah. all right, yeah. to learn combat and training, all right? Yeah. Whether it be MMA, some type of, you know, judo, yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, 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 you know, boxing. Knife you training. Know what I'm saying? Uh, would you, uh, knife training, com combat, Yeah, knife guns. combat. All right, oh, and they, they they know how to uh, disassemble and assemble guns. Yeah, all right, you know, what I mean? but by the age of fucking ten, you know what yeah. I'm saying? You know what I mean? So yeah, so they're man, used to this, man. Right. You Americans are soft, man. That's right. All you do is play Call of Duty. All right, you play Call of Duty, smoke fucking blunts, yeah. uh, drink lean, okay, <laughs> and, and celebrate Pills. fucking oh. Pride Month. You guys are. It's uh, true. You you. you are, you're grown adults uh, confused, all right, about your fucking uh, uh, your gender. I don't know. I think I'm a woman. You're, you're fucking six three. Fucking, you got uh, a dick and balls. You're six back three. Hair. You all right? Back hair. All right. Back hair. And you're confused if you're a man or a woman. Man, that nigga. That's why the Lord's gonna destroy this place, man. Right. I was working, bro. This nigga walked up looking like Kevin McHale with a fucking dress on, bro. Folly, bro. Straight folly. Folly, man. Hey. And, and, and 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 you'll lose your job. If you call that person a sir. Right. Yeah. This man. You this have man. to call me a woman or I'm gonna get you fired. Whatever, bro. I, all right, bro. Look at GameStop, you say, who's fucking now? This man. You niggas start having a gorilla fit. I got a preset, bro. Go ahead, go ahead. Hey, this is Proverbs 3 and 31. It say, envy thou not the oppressor and choose none of his ways, man. The Lord give him strict instruction, man. Don't envy this nigga. Don't choose none of his ways. You got this one money. All right, you got niggas around here. That's five. You want to do this? Yeah, yeah, your life. Like, you know, Greek. Yeah. Greek. Anything this nigga saying, do, do, mimic. These niggas mimic this man. He's a, he's a man. Because yeah, he's a rulership right now. That's the only reason why Jake mimics this fucking punk. All right? But see, they don't realize the latter end of this man. Okay? Because these people don't understand biblical prophecies. Okay? That's why, and can you get uh, uh, where there's no vision, people perish, okay? They don't understand that this man is going to fall very, very soon. And it's going to be a destructive ending, too. It's Thanks. not just going to be him, you know, giving the uh, the crown over to the Israelites. And, oh, yeah. You guys got it now. You got the power. See, no, man, this guy is going to, the Lord is going to come back, literally fight this man, all right? And then he's going to uh, 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 fall terribly, okay? Oh, man. And then, and then anybody that's involved with it, then you're gonna fall terribly too, man. Right. That, that's the end of this place. That's right. Okay, because hey, you, you, if you're not fighting for your how about you got shot, okay, getting down with the, the, the righteous program, the Lord sees you as a, a goddamn enemy. Which you are. Because hey, if you're not with me, you're against me. That's the scripture say. And you can't skip out on that part of the meal. See, niggas think they're going to dine and dash. And, 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 and they're going to eat all these dainties. And then when the Lord come back to fuck these Edomites up, they're going to skip out on the meal. That shit ain't going to happen, bro. No head, join the head. They should not go up on it. Like the scripture says, that's the better going into it. Yeah. Uh, that's uh, Proverbs 29 and 18. Mm -hmm. Where there is no vision, the people perish. Yeah. So where there's no vision, the people perish. And that word vision goes into knowing the oracles of the Most High, basically knowing the scriptures, the prophecies, what's to come, all right? And that's why our people are through out here. You know, the, the scriptures talk about our people being as dry bones, basically skeletons, dead people, okay? You know what I'm saying? And they are, they're the walking dead. They All they do is go to and fro, 
all right, up and down the streets, not knowing what the hell is going on. They're just waiting for master to tell them, look, you got to do this and you got to do that. Yeah. All right. Can't eat unless you take yeah. the, the Look, yeah. look, I be feeling like Light Yagami out here looking at these niggas, man. They, all these niggas got their little number floating over their head. <laughs> expiration and, and, and when they're going to expire, shit. man. Yep. Yep. That's how I look at all you niggas. With an expiration date on your they shit. They see the movie they see. Like all they yeah. yeah. That's how I look at their ass. Yeah. Because nope. time is running out for all of this bullshit that you niggas want to do, man. That's right. Exactly. It, it, it's, it's coming to a halt, man. Yeah. All right? Look, jobs are, are, are becoming scarce. Major, it's not just little mom and pop shops that are closing. No, We're talking about major close. corporations cutting thousands and thousands of, 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 of their uh, of businesses, man. Yeah, yeah. Look, look at Walgreens. They're cutting 8,600 uh, stores. Good. 8,600 stores, man. Good. They're going to have Arnold Schwarzenegger the Terminator in that bitch doing your job. Man. Exactly. Robots. Robo cop in there, hey, Like I said hey, last week, hey, hey, Esau don't need you anymore. He's got I Jake, I Moab, I Ishmael. Yeah. Okay, he don't need you people anymore. He can get one. He could get one of his I, uh, you know, I nations to do the job now, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, slaughter bots. They could drop out the sky and go wipe, wipe out a city. All right, so city. Exactly, bro. See, people don't understand that the elite. I'll say this: the elite of this society. They're, they're psychopaths, like you, yeah. you people don't really get it. The ones that are really running the, the show, so to speak, okay, they are literally psychopaths and they're ready to slaughter you. They see you as, you, as useless eaters that need to go. All right, which I, I, I you know what's funny? They, I agree. I agree. I, agree. Yeah. I in the righteous sense. I agree. Okay? So that's the, that's, that's the mask that I have about Shamal Shah, man. You don't come serve him, you gotta, you gotta cut off and die. You, you're not down with the righteous program. You gotta go and cut off and die. That's the righteousness, man. So how much more us hasting in the kingdom, knowing this place is wicked, our people is doing it according to wicked ways after they get warned and admonished. So we doing this out of labor of love, sacrifice our life, and they stalk. They wag the head, and they they, 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 they continue on their way. And not only that, they stalk, they come against the prophet, man. Yep. So yeah, we agree that these elites are gonna come down, have a great wrath, and we believe in what's written. We agree that he's gonna come slaughter you niggas, you you, un, you wicked people, you rebellious people, man. And that's according to prophecy. Yep. Right. Whereas we are, we out here what laboring and believing and speaking on these things for happen, because that's showing our faith and works and the true power, because what's written is gonna happen. And, and I'll say this: hey, we're showing you all love. That's the funny thing. Yeah. Hey, but you, 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 you reject us. Hey, you push away the hand. Yeah, so and that's why. This, that's why the scriptures say what? Yeah, forsaking your own selves and not I. That's what the Lord said. Yeah. You're really forsaking your own selves, because really. Dude, this is what's gonna protect you in those latter yep. days, man. Right. How, how, how are you gonna uh, survive when there's no food, when there's a famine out here, when there's no water, no medication? Yep. How are you gonna survive, all right, when you got gangs and packs of people, all right, slaughtering individuals, raping yep. them to death? Yep. How are you gonna survive that? How, how are you gonna right? outrun a thermonuclear missile? That's my favorite fucking thing to say to you people. Right. How are you gonna survive a thermonuclear destru uh, uh, destructive attack, man? They, they can't outrun motherfucking, uh, 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 what's rush hour? No <laughs> ass can't get out of rush hour. How the fuck you gonna run out of this? You ain't going nowhere. It's over with. I know y'all see more videos with them, but you know what I mean? Run, I think they be in like, you know, war and rush with some shit. They be running. And they, they running, trying to get up out of there. You ain't got nowhere to go because this is wrong with a bomb on it. They're gonna put the hub with no bitch. Lock on. Blow on your ass right to Smith and Reed. They say what you can do. They can't get away. And they put in them movies like The Purge, The First Purge, when they was in the project New York. Black dude that was popping out the trucks and shit, and them drones flew past and cleared their ass up. Yeah. 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 yeah, and see, this was gonna be this was the funniest part about it to me. Yeah. Me and the brother Murph was talking about this shit earlier today because of some shit, some things that happened, not pertaining to this, but the concept though still. See, at the end of the day, you people don't got the Lord, man. You don't, which means that you don't have faith. So once this shit start going going down. You're not even going to be able to process a way where you can come out on come out on the other end clean when these situations start happening. Man. See, with when things happen to us, and that's why the Lord puts us through all these things that He puts us through now, so that when that day comes and we, the Lord willing, we still enduring, that it's going to be second nature for us to just trust the Lord and not worry about shit, man. You know, but all these people. They gonna be worried. They not gonna know what to do. They ain't gonna have no faith. And then when they try to kill themselves, the Lord not gonna fucking let them do it. Man. It ain't gonna be no uh, quitting early and, 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 and what they call that shit, rage quitting. <laughs> Taking the easy way niggas, out. Niggas not gonna unplug their router because they getting their ass put, man. And cut the game off. 
Ain't gonna be none of that. Nope. You gonna have to take whatever the Lord got for take you, man. That. You know? Take that. Yeah. <laughs> take that. Take <laughs> that. Cause like the brother said at the end of the day, we over here trying to enlighten y'all and get y'all right so you can just receive salvation. And Lord willing, we can too, you know? But at the end of the day, Jacob come by and scoff and talk shit. And the funny thing is, is that when you when you insult us, you're really insulting yourself, man. Cause the Lord got you in the bag, bro. You captured and ensnared by the things that we saying. So you want to insult us, you're the stupid man. You calling yourself stupid doing that. That's what it says, he that hated me, uh, despised his own life, rebel to both. Yeah, all they that uh, hate me, love death. Yeah, yeah. Brother Cody, because it came out. That's it, man. Second Edith, chapter 9, verse 9, and verse 10. Then shall they be in beautiful places, which now have abused my way. And they that have cast them away, despitefully, shall dwell in torment. That's where, where we're at right now. Okay, our people, right? They hate the way that Yahweh Shimon shot. All right, it's very evident. You know, that's why they keep. Uh, 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 I'll say this: every year they get more rebellious. Okay. Okay. okay? How do I piss off the Lord even more? You know what I'm saying? But it's good, bro. It's like, hey, man, you can hate all day. That's still not going to negate the fact that your whole watch from now is trying to destroy this place. You know what I'm saying? See, that's the thing we do with our people. They think. You know, uh, uh, get mad, okay? Shame you. Like I'm saying my way to victory. No. You know what I'm saying? Or if they turn around and act like it's not there, yeah, then everything's cool. No, yeah. it's still in your face, man. Yeah. You can't get in, around it. In the face. No? Hey, man, that's it. Uh, but you know what? Because that's what the spirit been in the air as of late, man. The apostle of the been sitting down recently, man. At the end of the day, a vast majority of you niggas just don't gotta, you just gotta go, man. And, and you're gonna have to respawn in the kingdom, man. Because cause it's no, the, what, like, the, like, like the other brother was saying, every year these niggas get farther and farther away from the course. And now these niggas so far gone, it's nothing that you can do to reel it back in. Yeah. They say you it's, can't, it's over. They off the handle now. Yeah, there's no, what do they say? Uh, you can't re rehabilitate these people. Right. They, they get a marinade in the wickedness. Yeah. You, know, you just sit there and get more and more. Hey, read that again, though. They fucked the whole oh, nigga rig up. It's still on, though. Oh, yeah, okay. Now, got the whole system. Oh, okay. fucked up. He fucked the nigga rig right up, bro. Yeah, it's gotta go like this. Alright, man. That bitch. But, uh. Y'all want me to hold? Uh, no. It's all good. Put it right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like this, And then that bitch. Oh. Yeah, there we go. I just thought that one was going to knock it up. That bitch is nigger red. I don't even remember the breakdown. Yeah, yeah, so like Yaki, my bad. I fumbled the ball. That bitch, man. Yeah, he fucking up. He don't want that bitch to be horizontal. Yeah, I can hold it. It should be good enough. No, I'm going to do that first. I'm going to do that again one more time. Hey, this is the book of 2nd Ezra, chapter 9 and verse 9. Then shall they be in pitiful case, which now have abused my ways. Exactly, you're going to be in a pitiful case. Look, when you can't eat, get your new cars, get a, 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 a look at your you know, Instagram, you're going to be through out here. Okay? Real shit. You people are going to be through. You're already done. A lot of you don't take showers. Okay? Don't brush your teeth. Don't take showers. Hey, that's, hey, you know, a lot, that's like, we always say that you niggas are uh, Edomites. A lot of you niggas is Elamites. <laughs> a lot of you niggas been converted into Elam out here smelling like shit, bro. Bum culture, bro. I walk past a motherfucker like 10 feet away and you can smell it. Like man, these hoes get a status when you smell good, Look, man. It's, I call it that good because I was just chopping the bitch up about this shit last night. I was like, oh my God, you smell so good. And you got the cologne in your pocket. I told him, I said, all these niggas in here stink. I'm trying to be a beacon of hope in this bitch. You got to be a beacon of hope, man. Because this shit is ridiculous out here, man. Hey, I know what this is right now. Every chance you get up on the tool and get booty up. Oh, how the fuck you know her? How you know her? <laughs> 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 That's 
gotta leave and rebuke that though. bitch. That said, you know, people are like that because when you actually go into like the law and all that stuff, oh, it talks about being. <laughs> What's the word I'm looking for? Clean, man. Yeah. All right, you gotta cleanse yourself. Like when you uh, look at the streets and all that. I was just about to say that, bro. It's a whole process. Yeah. yeah. Before they did anything, it was a whole process, man. Twelve, like twelve months. Like oh, that was for the woman. That's for the woman. She gotta be paying the oil for six months. That was uh, the heathen. Uh, uh, yeah. Heathen. Yeah. Uh, that was with uh, who was that? Was it Esther? Yeah. yeah. In the book of Esther, okay. you know, it talks about that. The one king, he had his women bathe in one oil for six months. Yeah. And then, then, then he had her, had her bathe in another oil for another six months, so she had to do it for a whole year before you even touched it. Huh? I'm a dick. You niggas need to that the guy rolls. Oh, man. On our period, man. On our period, shaking ass. Uh, hey, this bitch uh, said she let a nigga run a train on her. Her period, say two yeah, niggas yeah, fucked yeah. on her period, yeah, man. I know them niggas shot Did money. Say, That's the money like, energy. I said a couple, like a month ago, on some plants. Oh yeah, there was this one bitch. It was this one bitch I was fucking with, right? She said she overheard her. She, man, I heard my daddy on the phone talking to some bitch. She say I'm on my period. He say, baby. Only thing period stop is sinister. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, that's a battle, man. That yeah, shit wicked, not. man. Running so, red lights, man. That's, that's wicked vibration, man. And that's what the scripture tells us not to learn the ways of the heathen, man. Yep. The scripture tells us not to be and then be the oppressor, because that's the oppressive way, man. But our people are so far gone from our, from our hope, our commonwealth, you know, and the faith in the true power, man, that they they all fucked up, man. And, and the prophets out here to warn you, man, the scripture is written. Hey, because at the end of the day, man, it's a part of our culture to be clean. Yeah. It's a part of our culture Correct. to be fly. Correct each other. You know, even when you read about the priest going into the into the holiest of holies, they're going to breaking down the whole outfit. They're going to breaking down the process. Start cleaning yourself before you go in there yep. and everything. That's a part of our culture. And a lot of people think that it's redundant to have that in the scriptures, but it's in there for a reason. Man. Yep. Look at us now. Look at us now, man. Our people, the majority of our people got dreads, shags. Oh shags, wicked. That's right. more wicked than the dreads. <laughs> yeah, that's, right. that's, that's you know, shit. They, up they, 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 they don't oh. smoke They don't brush their teeth. Yeah. Yep. They're through, man. Like, legit, our people are fucking through, man. It's evident because, you know, look, our people are the laughing stock of the world. Right. Facts. Takes it serious. That's right. Facts. They, 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 they go to Bitch the ass nigga. They go to the hood to, to laugh at us, bro. Right. Yeah, yeah. Take your money. Yeah, take, take that. Money. I seen a nigga with a shag. He had, uh, he had a taper and the shag was under the taper. Bro. That shit wicked, man. And hey, that shit wicked as hell, bro. I said, God damn, you just pushing their line in the back of the back of their head? That's what it is. That's right. And I got one back y'all brothers up. This is the book of Isaiah, chapter 65 and verse 8. Thus saith the Lord, Yahweh, as the new wine is found in the cluster, and one saith, destroy it not, for a blessing is in it. So will I do for my servant's sake, that I may not destroy them all. Mm. Hey, and that's what it is, man. You have about Shemar Shai got his elect and his remnant as a beacon of hope, like the brothers were saying, man. And, and, that, and that's what we have about Shemar Shai back to save, according to John 17, and those that hear their word, man, and preaching that word, teaching that word as it is written. That's, right. that's why it's important to put on as the elect, we don't know. But by our faith and works, according to the scriptures, man, that is a clear indicator, you know, and that we can make it, man. If we continue in the things that's written, man, continue to add to our faith, virtue and virtue, discipline and temperance, and as the scriptures lay it out. Mm -hmm. hey, but these people, they revolt more and more. So when the destruction come, like the brother mentioned earlier, when the Lord starts to cut things off and take away things and bring that uh, uh, sore pain and destruction, hey, from uh, different avenues, man, these people are really going to know and feel it, man. It's going to be too late. You know, yep. that's why now is the time to, you know, repent. It says, verse 9, And I will bring forth a seed out of Jacob and out of Judah, and inherit of my mountain, and my elect shall inherit it, and my servant shall dwell there. So this is a future prophecy, man. But it starts while you have how about Shemmy Abishai saving that cluster, man. You know, that, that elect as a beacon of hope. Book of Psalms, chapter 110 and 3. Thy people shall be willing in the day of thy power. In the beauties of holiness from the womb of the morning, thou hast the due of the of thy youth. And you know, the Apostle the Bar was going into this not that long ago, man. See, these niggas, they don't want to listen now, they don't want to get right now, they don't want to do nothing.
nothing right now. But a day is going to come, and we believe and know that this is going to happen through faith, where eventually the Lord is just going to say that this shit is over with, man. Yeah. And he's going to anoint his men with that power, man. And, and when that day comes, all these people don't want to be ready to listen and get in line, and it's going to be too late, man. You're going to have to pay the bill for the shit you did. It's Take funny, that. like a, a couple years back, all right? You know, when the streets were locked down, because uh, of this uh, you know, CV-19 situation, right? People were quiet. People were listening, you know what I'm saying? Right. People were, were all ears then, because shit was fucking getting real. You know, but then things, you know, started opening back up. It started becoming business as usual. But see, we're entering into a phase where, because I'll say this, that, that situation, you know, three, four years ago, that was just a test run to see what they can do, see how people are going to react, you know what I'm saying? Because you got to remember, this all does these things called case studies, okay? And he documents everything, war games, all right? But eventually, it's going to get, for real work, like I, like I like to say, that curfew is not going to be an option. If you are out after 10 o'clock, 9 o'clock, whatever they say, you will be put to death. If you go out of your quarters, right? Let's say you live in, I'm just gonna use this as an example, sector one, right? And you just try to, you know, hop to sector two or sector without three no without no papers, you will be killed on site. Yep. Okay? No question. You know, and they're gonna break down the the the, the um the city by your neighborhoods, all right. Hey, you're from High Park, you know, you're from Bridgeport, you're from Rogers Park, you know, you're from Lincoln Park, you gotta stay there, that's it. Then they may, depending on which neighborhood you're in too, because some certain neighborhoods are bigger than others, they may cut it into two, okay? It might be uh, uh, like how they do it like this. They'll be like East Rogers Park, yeah. West Rogers Park, East Pilsen, West Pilsen, yeah. you know what I'm yeah. saying? Yeah. They're gonna do it like that, you know what I'm saying? And you people are gonna be stuck. And hey, see, this is why they're building things like this, what you see in front of you is to create that 15 minute city yeah. where all you have to do, okay, yep, is go downstairs yep. to your store, okay, or maybe down the street to get your hair cut or whatever. That's it. That's it. You see, they, they see they've been designing this right in front of you. Yeah, but they see that they put this in your face as something as luxury, yeah. okay? Yeah. Oh, you got your gym right there. Yeah. You have your, your target, that's a okay? Yeah. You have a doorman, <laughs> like the brother said, that's a trap. We even have a Starbucks. See, they're going attack. back to go. Yeah. They're going back to, uh, because see, these, these people that are ruling this society, their whole mentality from the beginning of their ascension to power has been to take us and put us in a feudal society that is perpetual. All right, and back in the feudal times, you couldn't just travel around whenever the fuck you wanted. Yeah. You know, like in, 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 in Japan, for example, they had it just like how the brother is talking. They had it chopped up into sections, and they had garrisons set up at every That's in the border. Scriptures. You know, right. and if you want to cross into this other, just to go to the neighboring village, you had to have paperwork from the lord of your, your, yep. your whole prefecture to give you permission to just go, to go even if it was just the distance of across the street, but it's a, it's across a border, if you don't got the paper, and you try to go over there without that, they're gonna kill you, or you're gonna get sent to hell and be to and tortured. That's, that's how they operated back then. Yeah, I, I wanna say this too, there's people that you mentioned the torture aspect. See, everyone's in jail, like, it's still rough, but see, it's gonna get you away from this day and fuck it up. that type of spirit again where they're gonna legit torture you all right yeah, yeah. You're, you're not gonna have anything to say they're gonna they're gonna put a muzzle on you and they're gonna start fucking delaying you bro yeah, yeah. You alive, bro because it ain't gonna be no uh human rights I knew that bitch was gonna drop too so I just didn't catch it down. yeah I show was like hold it I need to charge that bitch anyway let me Right, hey, but the point being though, they're gonna get into that type of spirit again. Hey, okay, like how the brother said, you're not gonna have, oh, what do they call, uh, rights, human rights. You Look, man, they don't even see you as a, uh, they see you as three-fifths of a person anyways. You're not even a whole human. A human, you're considered an animal. And yeah. in, in their mindset, because look, see, these people don't fucking read, man. They don't know shit. Hey, back in the day, when, when these uh, Spaniards, Okay, we're, we're, we're these conquistadors were, you know, uh, uh, taking everything over. They said, look, we can do these things to these people because okay. they're not even yeah. human. They're, they're animals. animals. So we can cut the uh, the, uh, the, the, the woman's stomach open, take the baby out, and, and just stomp the baby to, uh, to death, man. It's cool. 
They're yeah. not even a human. Yeah. Okay. We're not. We, we can scalp. We can scalp these natives. It's cool. Yeah. They're not human. <laughs> Cut your hands okay? off. All type of shit. Man. You know what I'm saying? We, we can castrate them. They're not human. You see? Yeah. And that's what they're gonna get, go back into because people forget that, like I already mentioned earlier, that the so-called white man Esau Edom is a fucking psychopath. This dude is not fucking right in the head. Demon, he don't demon. have. See, Jake has like that. That um, in their uh, mind, they have that <laughs> compassion in them, right? It, it's actually literally. It's um. It, it, it's in our DNA. From, I think these niggas from Pleasantville. You know what I'm saying? Because I was gonna say this. They show you that in a uh, uh, jangle. Yeah. Remember? Yeah. He he was going into like the whole brain yeah, and all that yeah, shit, yeah, yeah, and going yeah, into yeah, the yeah. different uh. uh you know, sex and I forgot yeah, how he yeah, uh, yeah, uh, worded yeah. Uh, shit. Uh, yeah, yeah. You know, but point being though is, they study Jake. Jake, Jake has compassion, but these Edomites, they don't have that. All these, all these psychopaths, right? When they look at their their, their uh, the frontal lobe, their uh, uh, the, what is it, the back? What yeah. Is the, uh, the back. What, what is that piece called right here? Yeah, I do with them all <laughs> Yeah, all, whatever that shit is, man. <laughs> whatever. You know what I'm saying, right? <laughs> You know, yeah, yeah, like yeah. Esau, Cortex, yeah, all yeah, yeah, like Esau oh, uh, doesn't have like this um particular um like it shows like a heat pattern or whatever. They don't have it in the back oh, of their head, and that yeah. and that uh, uh, goes into like uh, if one has compassion or not. Yeah. They literally don't have it. Yeah. Uh, 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 um, and the majority of these um psychopaths are all Edomites. That's it. So hey. who, look, man, the, the dude at your job, hey, the, the the goddamn politician that shakes your hand, that dude is a fucking straight up killer, and he won't think twice about it. Hey, they, yeah, yeah. They, they showed a little bit of that movie. Um, 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 what's that movie, man? Civil War. When they was passing through trying to get some gas and shit, and then buddy them had two uh, Edomites hanging up. They weren't even dead. They said they've been hanging by the arm for like three days. They've been just beating their ass and shit. And they was like, man, what y'all think we should do with them? Should I kill them or should I just let they let them go or some shit? But that was just on the movie on a on a low level, man. It's gonna come a day in time. Well, yeah, they're gonna be bashing a motherfucker head in the streets with a hammer. Shit, nigga, fuck a movie. These niggas was uh just 50, 60 years ago. Bro, I done read stories, bro. They, they was bagging up Jakes down south. And, and, and they caught this one Jake, and they'll light him on fire. And then they'll put the fire out. Let him sit there for like 20 minutes. Then light him on fire again. Then put the fire out. And these niggas sat there for like two days just doing that shit, man. Hey, eating, eating sandwiches, listening to this nigga scream and, 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 and cook slowly over time, man. But they want to celebrate the fourth. Cutting yeah. off niggas' rods and putting them in jars and shit, hey, paws. It's a, all type of it's shit. A, yeah. it's, a, it's a family of eating white man and a woman. They just got booked for um yeah. adopting them little two boys, Jake boys, and putting their ass in slavery, making them work in the barn. Yeah. I got something for you. This yeah. is uh, Habakkuk 2 and 4. Behold, his soul, which is lifted up, is not upright in him. I was thinking that. All right? Perfect. Hey, the, 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 the Lord is telling you that the soul that's in him is not upright, meaning he's not righteous. Man, but the just shall live by his faith. Okay? And we're going to live by faith if we're part of the elect. We're going to have faith that Yahweh Bashim Shah is going to stop this man. That's right. You see, that's the problem with our people. They, they got their whole spirit, right? As it says in the book of Revelation, who's going to make war with the beast? Yeah. Basically, meaning who can stop this guy? Yeah. How, how, how could you fight him? L yeah. Look at his whole system. All these but see, we see, we, 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 because you know what? It goes back to that whole situation, all right, with the Joshua and Caleb, okay? About that it goes back to that. The, the elect uh, represent the, basically Joshua and Caleb, the northern and the southern yeah. kingdom, yeah. all right? Yeah. You see? And they had the what? The, the, the righteous report saying like, no. We're gonna take him down. Yeah. All right, it don't matter. See, all the other Jakes that went before them, they were scared. Oh, they had that pussy ass spirit. They're tall. Nigga, fuck these niggas, man. All right. You see, but we see, ain't scared of this shit, man. We ain't scared of you, yeah. bro. But see, the average Jake, and it go back to what I was saying earlier. These people, they don't have the Lord, so it's hard for them to look at situations where the odds don't look good in your favor on paper. Right. And to believe that they're gonna be able to make it out of that, man. Yeah. But you know what it is, I like I always, I've been saying this for a couple of months now. They like to put a cap on the Lord, like He can't do, you know, uh, save us through divine intervention. Yeah. Right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Like yeah. He's not yeah. in control yeah. of Esau or something. They, they, that's what's very fucking yeah. irritating about our people. They'll sit there, go to church, say they believe in God, so on and so forth, right? But they don't think that the Lord can actually do something that that are uh, marvelous. It's written. Yeah. But the funny thing is, because. See, that's the thing. Esau has changed you niggas from worshiping Yahweh Bashim, Yahweh Shai, and believing in his abilities and the things that he's going to do into believing what Esau can do. These niggas believe Esau can defeat the Lord, man. Yeah. That's, why they, that's why they act the way they act. That's why they don't ever think America is going to end. 
That's why they think this shit is just gonna be like it is now and forever, man. Look, this ain't fucking Independence Day with Will Smith, you know, right? Big Willie style, all right? This shit ain't happening, right? <laughs> we're, 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 we're him and some fucking, you know, fake Jew are gonna go into a name <laughs> out your fucking you know, mouth. Go get, get into a fucking <laughs> aircraft and just shoot some fucking, yeah. you know, nuke bombs yeah, and yeah, destroy yeah. the fucking uh, f uh, mothership. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a lot, you know. Hey, Jeff Goldblum, a Jake, though. So oh, yeah, of course he is. He's Jake, but you know what I'm trying no, to say? No, God, God, no, 100%. 100%. 100%. Yeah, that shit ain't happening. No, you know? that negative. And see, and that's how Jake, Jake really believes that, man. Jake thinks that Esau has already defeated the Lord. Yeah. Jake don't even think the Lord is real, man. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah shit. You, you have a lot of our people. They believe in signs and energy now. Yeah. That's what they That's, that, that's that neo black, new age black shit. You gotta drink, you gotta drink a cup of gold, brother. And then once you do that, it's gonna put you on the upper netter. And then you're gonna meet your higher self. And then once you meet your higher you self, a, then you're gonna meet God, also known as the righteous and beautiful black woman, brother. Now pass that blood, brother. <laughs> Man, bro. You teeth and then once your dreads grow down to your ankles, then you will really be <laughs> on a super guy. You're going to be look, a, if that's what Super God, Saiyan, where you think they got the Super Saiyan 5 from? Why you think his head long and when he's Super Saiyan 5, bro? Then they going to say, get the book of, um, stupid, man. get the book of judges and they going to read Samson. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Stupid, man. Niggas are fucking stupid. It's a nigga on Instagram with dreads to his feet for real, man. This nigga, he, he be like, nah, I ain't never cutting my shit. The nigga dreads is literally on his bro, ankles, bro. You walk up with your shit like that and a nigga will believe anything you say, bro. That shit gay, man. A nigga will believe anything you say you walk up like that. I got, yes. I got a precept. Yeah. This is 1 John 5 and 13. These things have I written unto you that ye that believe on the name of the Son of God, that ye may know that ye have eternal life, and that ye may believe on the name of the Son of God. And that's why we got the records written, man. We got the accounts written, how our Lord and Savior, how our power to save us through divine intervention, man. Yep. And when we were outnumbered, we got accounts where you how about Shem how was shy saved us through divine intervention man That's right when the heath was on our ass when the famine was going throughout the land when uh, righteous men were shut up in pits and dens with lions man with the accounts is written that how you how about shamal shai made divine intervention man how he made elijah run full speed off a of mountain man how he made him go 40 days without eating just off drinking and eating a uh, little portion man he was able to sustain himself for 40 days the curse of the oil you kept replenishing that he was able to help the uh, the widow woman that was in the jail and to be able to eat and sustain himself, man. All these accounts and records written that we believe on the name of the of the son and the heavenly father, man. And when we go into scriptures, we got his name. It's not an idol. Right. You know, it's, it's not this madness that this world pushed because it goes back to the beginning of the lesson. Learn not to wear the heathen. Yep. And our people learn to wear the heathen by trusting in these names, trusting in these false ways, not believing what's written. But the scripture says, these are written that you may believe. And it's also written in John, the 20th chapter. I got a precept, bro, to back up what you just said. This is the book of 2 Kings, chapter 6. I'm going to just start down. Um, this, this, this is 2 Kings, chapter 6, and verse... 15 and when the servant of the men of Yahweh was risen early and gone forth behold an host compassed the city both with horses and chariots Man. and his servants said unto him alas my master how shall we do thank you bro. and he answered fear not right. for they that be with us are more than they that be with them Yep. So, hey, it's, it's more with us than with them. And that's what these people don't understand. At all times, it's like that, man. <laughs> yeah. At all times, the Lord is dealing, man. At all times, his chariots, it says the angel of the Lord, a cap around them that fear him, man. That's it. And these people don't have that revealed it to them. That's but that's it. the reality at all times, man. Yep. Saying that, hey, the man of the Lord, the Lord has bestowed this faith upon us to believe in these things. And honestly, to know that these things are true, man. That's right. This is verse 17. And Elisha prayed and said, Yahweh, I pray thee. Open his eyes that he may see, and Yahweh opened the eyes of the young man. And that's, and that's a, a key point right there. The Lord's gonna open your eyes to see. For the majority of our people, the Lord has kept them closed. Yep. All right. That's why they're still asleep right now. All right. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Yeah. And he saw, and behold, the mountain was full of horses and chariots of fire round about Elisha. Mm, <laughs> so, yeah. Like I was just thinking of this, Mr. Sandman. Won't you bring me a dream? <laughs> that, 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 that's that's Jake right now, man. Yeah.
never seen they, 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 got, <laughs> they got their, their dream sand in their eyes, bro. That's it. You got the Tony Ferguson. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Get them sand. <laughs> These niggas are blending. The when when something ain't revealed until you, that's being the veil is still open. That's right. When you reveal it, you pull the veil. The Lord put, had to pull the veil out your ass, man. Or you got a blindfold on. That's right. Hey, man. And, you know, the scriptures say that, you know, yeah, how was I didn't do miracles for people that didn't believe, man. That's exactly. If you didn't believe, they then you, you was just going to be busted and disgusted at the end of the day. <laughs> that's John 316. Man. I like it, bro. <laughs> and that's what's going to happen to all these people, man. They slap away. Because they don't want to believe, and because they don't they don't think Esau can be stopped, you're right. Hey, I got he one. He can't be stopped. When it come to you, you're going to get fucked up. That's facts. Right nope. They ain't got that hedge. They ain't got that protection. The scripture says where there's no hedge. The, the possession is spoil you, man. And a lot of these men is finna get spoil you. A lot of these women finna get spoil you because they ain't trust and fear you. How about Shami Howard Shah? That's right. Y'all like the ways of the heathens. These heathens about to show you the activities that they really like getting into. Man. You know, that behind closed doors shit. Hank was just going into it. What's Cat Pack? Oh, what I'm gonna say? Oh, yeah, no, keep reading. No, read that one more time. Kind of, kind of. Uh, you want me to read 17 again or read 18? What, because it. 17 again, okay, kind of. Yeah, read that part. Con. The second king, six and seventeen, and Elisha prayed yep. and said, Yahweh, I pray thee, open his eyes that he may see. And Yahweh opened the eyes of the young man, and he saw. And behold, the mountain was full of horses and chariots of fire round about Elisha. That's, that's pretty much it. That's all we need. Con. So, hey, like the brother said, you know, as the scriptures say, that there was more, uh, uh, more angels than uh, of those Assyrians. Right. Okay. Yeah. And see, that's the thing. See, the Lord doesn't have to show you things, man. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? But with the with the naked eye, so to speak. Man. You know what I'm saying? There's there's angels everywhere. Yeah. Man. But people don't Me. they Me. don't believe it because they because they it's got to be something tangible. They got to touch it. Yeah. Taste right. it. See it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's an anime called Blue Exorcist, and <laughs> basically the main character he had he was never revealed basically truth, and when he when his eyes was open he's he'd seen it was just demons that were demons on people. He's like, damn, yeah. so it was like this the whole town? Yeah. Well, he could have yeah. never yeah. seen it until it was revealed to him, man. Yeah. 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 Hey, and a lot of these people are gonna uh they're gonna have a rude awakening because even <laughs> even though the Lord is not gonna necessarily open their eyes to the truth in order to be you know receive salvation, you know, these people's heads so fried that they don't even understand how wicked all these people that are around them are. Good. But you know, all these people got their head and their phone and, and they paying attention to a bunch of shit that's not that don't matter and, and because they can't see things through the spirit they don't perceive the wickedness of a lot of these people all right but a day is going to come where these demons not going to have to hide no more and they're going to just be out front with how wicked they are and that shit is going to fuck a lot of you people's brain up man to, to understand just how much you surrounded by wickedness like the yeah. brother mentioned with with the show man that's a heavy even because we see you know the Lord has given us discernment and, and, and the ability to read spirits on people. And I and I, I was I tell Jake all the time, I don't you look at these, it's demons on all these niggas, oh, man. Yeah, 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 for sure. and, and some of these people are so wicked that it's not just a, a countenance when you see the demon. Like you can actually see the demon looming over some of these like motherfuckers. That nigga bro. Who like hanging, up. like hanging over. You see the hey, this shit is wicked, bro. Bitch walking you know, past, all, she just mean mugger. All these transformers <laughs> and these cross-dressing motherfuckers and shit. These niggas got the demon holding the puppet string. You can see the demon holding the puppet strings walking these that's niggas right. down the street. And street. that's the scriptures, man. They take covering, but now of this is Isaiah 30. Yeah. Woe to the rebellious children that take covering, but not of my spirit, that they may add sin to sin. Go down to Egypt, but they trust not in the Holy One of Israel, man. And that's their problem. The brother just... That, that's what it is, man. That wickedness is vibrating, permeating around these people, causing them to err, causing them to stand. They feel filth. Yeah. They ain't believe the words. They ain't believe the record. They ain't believe the prophets. They despise the prophets. They they was judged on the outward appearance, yeah. and they was a fucking being wicked, man. So they, they got to pay for that. Yeah, hey, and they got their ears stuffed with um lies, man. Yeah, their the ears is stuffed with lies, and then your ears have been sewed up and zip tied up shut. You can't hear shit else. You can't see shit else. Mm -hmm. Scriptures talk about how their their conscience seared with the hot iron. Like an urn. Like an urn. What to bring out? You gotta think about it like this: If you have a hot iron <laughs> and you stuck it on your leg. There's gonna be an imprint on your leg forever. No? That's, right. That's how it is with, with these people, bro. Yeah. They're, 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 it's like they're, a brand. They're, yeah, they got they're, they're branded with wickedness. Uh, they're branded with wickedness. The truth. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that Greek. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Greek. 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 Let this be the last scripture. And then we're like, oh. <laughs>
Cause you niggas gonna be, you think the demons on these other people is gonna fuck you niggas up. Wait till you see the demon that's on you. The Lord gonna let you see the demon that got you in the bag, nigga. Man. <laughs> Especially all you um alternatives. And you know what's so funny? A lot of them be seeing that shit when they're uh, you know, higher off of uh, 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 mushrooms, uh, yeah, acid. Yeah, you thought yeah. you were they, 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 That's why they always tell you, don't look in the mirror. When you're on those type of drugs, yeah. they'll tell you that like, hey, don't, it's not good to look in the mirror and see your reflection. Because yeah. really what you're seeing is a demon now. Yeah. All right, but... Uh, hey, right fast, this is the book of Isaiah, chapter 6 and verse 9. It say, and he said, go and tell this people, hear ye indeed, but understand not. And see ye indeed, but perceive not. Make the heart of this people fat, and make their ears heavy, and shut their eyes, lest they see with their eyes, and hear with their ears, and understand with their heart, and convert and be healed. So the Lord got him in a trick bag, man. You know he 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 he, he got you blinded, man. You didn't get that eye cell. All right, you just you just out here wandering around aimlessly in Babylon the Great. You can't hear the truth, you can't see the truth, you can't understand the truth because your man, your heart, your sight is filled with the the the, the, the lust pride, of the flesh, man. the pride of life. And you know you knew what I was gonna go for. Yeah, so yeah, man. So they can't get it, man. Hey, if a nigga can't get it, we moving on. Fuck him. We ball. The truth the only thing that That's perfect. Man. Um, Isaiah six, sum it up. That whole Isaiah 6, sum it up. They can't get it. They're not going to get it. They're going to get destroyed. Yep. Huh. Yeah, we're going to give all praise, honor, and glory to you. Yeah, I will. 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 Y